Today's question is, do angels really exist? It's a great question. You know, the modern mind has been trained to believe the lie that if I can't see it, it doesn't exist. But we know this isn't true. You can't see gravity, but you know it exists, or the wind or sound. As a matter of fact, when you look at the universe and the size of it, to believe that we're just the only ones around that really matter is a bit naive and arrogant. The truth is we've all felt the impact of the supernatural realm. There are things that we cannot explain. And the Bible is clear that angels do exist. Over 300 times we have eyewitness accounts of humans interacting with angels. So if angels exist, what do they do? Well, the first thing is that they are messengers. That's actually what the word angel means. And the reason that that's important is because it means we can trust the word of God. God sends his angels with messages directly from his throne room. You can trust his word. But there's another even more powerful reality. Angels are warriors. We just passed Christmas, and I was thinking about that first Christmas scene with the shepherds uh, in the fields. And often, I don't know if you're like me, I have this faulty image of angels, kind of like these fat, chubby little babies with a bow and arrow, right? At Valentine's Day, that's not what happened. So when the heavens opened, it wasn't a boys' choir singing. It was the warriors of heaven. It was a war cry. God was coming into the world to deliver and save his people. And so you need to know that angels do exist. And that's important because you can trust God at his word and you can trust that he has angels guarding and watching over you. That's what Psalm 91 verse 11 says. It says, for he, God, will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. And that should give you incredible confidence today. So do angels exist? Absolutely. And because they do, you can trust God.